Good morning, my fresitas. We are going to be getting ready together today. Um, so this will just be a get ready with me. Uh, I'm going to work and I normally don't get ready for work, but today I start late, so I will get ready. Um, I'm going to start by putting moisturizer on my face. I have dotted my moisturizer on my face and, and then I'm also going to dot some azelaic acid um, to maintain my face from getting oily. I learned this from Michaela on TikTok who I love. Now I'm going to put my sunscreen on, mine's by The Ordinary. Just applying some sunscreen on my eyelids because your eyelids are sensitive, so or delicate, I should say. So I'm gonna protect them, and then I'm gonna go in with the Tula Skin Care. Um, this is a cooling eye brightening stick balm, whatever it's called, just for under my eyes. And lastly, I like to use the Clinique Moisture Surge for um, the eyes. For um, it helps grip the primer, or that made no sense. It helps grip the concealer under your eyes. And I like to do my eyes first, but I put all this on already so that. My face is prepped when it's time to do my face. So I'm going to go ahead and prime my eyes with the Morphe Eyelid Primer. I'm going to be using my new baby today for the first time, so I'll kind of, um, I'll see how it goes and all that and I'll talk about it a little in the next video I'm gonna do which will be like kind of like a first impressions um, on some of the new makeup I've gotten. I'm gonna go in with this color called 90s. It's just a neutral color so I'm just gonna put that all over my lid. Then I'm going to go in with the color triple. And blend this out in my crease. Next I'm going to go in with this blending brush and the color Let's go wing it. This will be my dark color right here in my crease. And I'm just stamping it in and then I'll blend it out.
so far I'm really liking these eyeshadows they're very creamy and blendable so that's super great I'm gonna go ahead in with that same blending brush and just clean it off here a little I use this to clean them off in between I use the same brush the two colors I'm gonna go in with the color Boss Man, which is like a shimmery brown. And I'm just gonna go right here on the outside and inside corner. It's not too shimmery, which I like, cause I'm not trying to make this really shimmery. This is just going to help darken a little because this look is going to have a star in the middle and you guys will see how beautiful this shade I'm going to use is in just a few minutes. I'm just slightly connecting them here in the middle. without adding extra product, just what's on my brush and just blending it. If you ever need to go back into your transition color to soften things up, go ahead and do so. Okay, now for the start, it's called Macaroni. It's the most beautiful gold I've ever seen. Look at how beautiful. This is why I applied it with my finger because I don't know if it's gonna be this beautiful if I do it with a brush. Now that it's on, I'm gonna go in with this little um, brush with that boss man color and just blend the two together on the edges and up here we're gonna go ahead and do our brows now with our next lift and snatch pens I use Ash Brown for my inner corner and Espresso for the rest of my brow. Now I'm going to go ahead and with the Maven Beauty Black Eyeliner. Okay, the only, thing I, the only thing I would suggest is um, maybe applying your liner before this glitter, if you use this glitter from this palette, because I'm applying it and the glitter's kind of not, not letting the liner go on top of it. It's kind of, the glitter's kind of like smearing on top of the liner, like sort of peeking through. But it's fine. 
Now for our bottom lash line, we're going to go in with this color called Stories. I'm going to go in two thirds of the way. And then as much as I hate to use two palettes, I need a lighter version of this. So we're going to go into the Huda Beauty Pastel Mint. And we're going to use this color on the bottom right hand corner to blend this out. As well as on the inner third. And with this shade from the Manifest Dream Big Palette, Be Perfect, I'm going to use this shade called, I think it's called 11, as my inner corner highlight. And I want something a little more gold. So, yes, I'm going to go with the Juvia's Place loose highlighter in Cleo. This is more of a gold color. I already put some of that other one on there, but I'll just put this on top. Finally, gonna apply our lashes. I also just got this glue card called Star Glue, and you guys can get it at Maggie'sBeautyTherapy.com and use my code Fresa90 for some money off. Although it's already very inexpensive and it's very very good, I really like it. And since I'm going to work, I don't want to look wild because, well, it's work. So I'm going to go in with the La Lash Lover from Bella G Cosmetics, which you could also use my discount. Also is for Sanandi on her website. Everything will be linked in the, down, in the description bar on the bottom. Let them get tacky like 30 seconds. 